Hey there and welcome to this 5 vs 5 on the Twisted Tree Line in League of Legends. We are playing with a Shen, a Teemo, a Poppy, a Misfortune and an Ash versus a Katrina, a Cassidy, a Gangplank, a Mal, Zahar and a Teemo. I am the one playing as the Poppy using the Ignite and Ghost for faster ganking. Now let's resume the game. Pretty standard setup, I'm going to speed it up just a little because the first 30 seconds of the game there is absolute balls all going on. So as you see I split off into the bottom lane, two people go into the middle lane which I'm not used to seeing and Ash goes solo top. I've always been used to the middle being the solo lane and that is kind of what I point out here in this game. I kind of go two mid, can you get down here? And like no, but it doesn't matter all that much. And then I was about to say, minions, minions have spawned, so I'm gonna play it on regular speed. So if you look, Timo's just sitting there waiting for an opponent. Ash and Shen are doing the exact same. While me and Misfortune are just kind of camping in the bush, waiting for minions to spawn. I've always used this tactic right here: is wait in the bush. It's always worked for me while playing Poppy. I'm just coming out the bush, but there we go. There's the first initial engagement, but obviously it is completely ignored. While well, I just go straight in to feed myself on some creep. So we've had our first engagement while well, up there, there they've had to chase down Timo. Timo's going in for some last hits on the mobs, obviously trying to feed. But I'm just sitting down at the bottom lane getting all the last hits that Misfortune couldn't get. So we're already up at their tower for some reason. Oh, I've never been this fast up at the tower. Usually they're up at my tower by now, but... There we go. We see Gangplank just kind of trying to ward us back. But obviously he can't come too close. There are two of us now. If we go to the middle lane, we see Timo just kind of casually strolling in. I level up there and on the top lane there is an engagement but a very little one that doesn't mean nothing so we're already up at the tower we're getting pushed she's getting damaged by the tower but obviously I'm not a noob poppy anymore I now have my level one ability no my one ability which is devastating blow which this is why Poppy sucks at the start of the game because you usually buy charge at the start of the game but obviously once you level up again you buy devastating blow which is obviously your main source of output nuke as you know all the rest of your abilities are like and obviously we we get the first blood but we don't get the first death due to that turret which is some boo ba boo if you ask me correctly. Timo's just sitting up there, middle lane, doing his stuff while they're sitting on there, kind of harassing each other. So I've leveled up again and I bought my Paragon of Dementia. I'm just kind of trying to last hit minions without trying to get too close to Gangplank or I will be Gankplanked, as I like to say. So there's me running back with Poppy. Actually, no, I do go in for a last hit stupidly, but nah. Gangplank's chasing me down right here. Nothing much happens. He goes on to feed off some mobs while Timo's up at their tower. He ain't destroying the tower, though, which is a crying shame. Actually, might be, because I know this replay's terrible. So, obviously, I tried to return here, but I'm really low in health. I actually missed a lot of it. Another word of note, I'm using a mixed poppy build here. I've got all armor pen, like runes and stuff, mana regen and health regen. So, all in all, the build I use kind of supports everything I want to do. Like, I've got regrowth pendant so I can be a tank and I get more stuff to make me a tank. I also buy some ability power stuff, I also buy some armor stuff, I also buy other stuff, essentially. So they're already up at their turret turret tower if I call it a turret just ignore me they're already up at their turret kind of pushing pushing forward actually I've said the wordy up at their turret but 300 times that there we go there's not an engagement with Timo per se but you know you can tell that he's being pushed back and there is and there is something going on 
there's me just going back to buy my boots of speed so I can later upgrade them into my ninja tabby. I've kind of perfected this build with Poppy, as Poppy is my favourite hero in League of Legends, it kind of seemed right to kind of make up my own custom build with her and write it down in a bit of paper so that I didn't forget. Just kind of gaining XP off of creeps here, that's Poppy's main objective. Get yourself as high level as possible early game. The higher level you are early game, the higher level you are just about for life. So there's the ding again, and I upgrade my charge. And obviously there's a disconnect. The gangplank has disconnected from our lane. So I'm up at their tower, or turret, whatever you want to say, just kind of wailing on it. Obviously knowing that Gangplank, since he's disconnected, can't be the bloody Gilded Rose in all of this. Knowing that this tower is going down one way or another. M Misfortune just needs to hurry her ass up. Timo again, up at the tower, uh, doing absolutely nothing for the fear of Gank. From Katrina, I think her name is, if I remember. Well, Ash and Chen are kind of pushing top lane against this lowly Teemo. Again, feeding off creeps. What I do with Poppy quite a lot. So, there's the ding. Getting attacked by attack. I think this kills me. Yep, it does. There's the death of me. I, I got really cocky for kills really cocky for kills this game. That turret, that same turret I think kills me twice. I I don't know why but this game I, I felt really greedy for kills. So that's kind of what happened. So obviously spawn I'm just gonna speed this up just a tad due to the fact that there's nothing going on in the other lanes obviously and I'm just kind of wanting Poppy to hurry. They are pushing the enemy tower here, but nothing too interesting back to normal speed. So, Miss Fortune and I are just kind of going for the tower. Kahnplug's disconnected, there's nothing the enemy team can do. An enemy has been slain. And Timo just got another kill against Katrina. If I'm, st I'm probably saying her name all wrong, I, I say a lot of these heroes wrong. Like, Timo has a space in it. I don't know if it's Te-Emo or Timo. So, it's Timo. I don't know Poppy's Poppy because it, I'm Scottish. So, we're up at the tower. That's it. The tower's dead. There's nothing. And there's Gangplank back on back in the game. Too late to save the turret, tower, whatever you call it, from being destroyed. That's us one tower down because I think we're the first row to destroy a turret. Amazing stuff, people. I didn't see the need to recall, so I'm just kind of pushing forward. Well, up at top lane, there is a big engagement with Shen, but I missed it, and Shen is dead. That's Cassadin taking Shen's life, going in for Ash, most likely. He might get it. No, he doesn't. The minions might, but then again. Ash is level 7 and does only have a Doran's Blade. Probably gonna upgrade it into something. There, I get the bloody gank on ca and Gangplank, but I just thought instead of, um... I think this guy kills me. I really do. No, I, I tower dive him, get the kill. No, I don't. The, I think the turret kills me outright. Nope. Okay, I'm predicting this game wrong, but... I shouldn't have tower dived, I should have went back, fed off the creeps, but hey, this is what I'm doing this series. As we see, we've got Katarina, what's her name? It is Katarina. Katarina, the ninja, Takanawa, goes in for the Timo. Timo cannot take this, Timo's a very ganky, heavy hero. Timo might just go down, nope. Timo manages to recover. And there's me going in for the Ninja Tabby, which is probably, it's a really great thing in my arsenal. It gives 
12 dodge and 25 armor. Oh yeah, and I also buy a ruby crystal. Usually I buy the mana. I just got lost for it. Usually I buy the mana crystal, but I had, I, I felt like I was taking too much damage, so I did kind of just go fuck it, ruby crystal, let's give myself some health. Misfortune's kind of up, just trying to do damage to Timon, doing quite a good job of it, I guess. Harassment's everything in this game, like, the slightest bit of damage is a wee bit good. So, he gets the heal, and there's Gangplank. And, Timo comes in. I'm pretty sure I could manage to kill Timo. Nope, she, she steals my kill. And there's the ding. Obviously, I'm gonna buy my ulti, because that this is when Poppy becomes amazing. And people need to face this. When Poppy gets her ulti, don't, don't fuck with her. Especially not if she has Ignite. Ignite with Poppy's ulti is the greatest thing in the world. And there we go, there's a good job for the kill, well done. And there's our Teemo kind of forcing the lane a little bit. Katarina the ninja. And there's Shin and Ash kind of pushing. They have not destroyed their turret yet, but neither, is, neither have they. We're just kind of the only ones that are pushing that hard but then again we're playing with a newbie gangplank it ain't hard to destroy a turret if you've got a gangplank that barely knows his asshole from his elbow I'm sorry I've been really harsh here I know I'm not the best but damn it I w I take pride in knowing I'm better than this guy there we go I'm pretty sure I kill him so don't stand in the fire and we we kill each other again my greed for kills I'm just gonna again do the mandatory thing of speeding I kinda no one was communicating this game like the enemy team usually kind of go haha killed each other then or something you know no nope, nothing this game I got absolutely bugger all I just I'm really under level Timo's level 11 for fuck's sake and I'm just at <laughs> level 7 and I'm coughing up a lung <coughs> Not a good thing while I'm casting. Misfortune comes back to meet me, but I don't think... Nope, she recalls. Does she really trust me?